It seemed like a gift from on high, just too good to be true. A valuable artwork left by the world's best-known street artist, Banksy, in his hometown of Bristol, and just yards from a youth club struggling to pay its bills and threatened with closure. So the club's leader decided to remove it from its wooden panel and take it in for safekeeping. I'm used to making, taking risks. This is one of those risks. Do I or don't I? I did. And, hey, I was buzzing all the way home, thinking, do you know what I've just done? I've lifted a Banksy, for crying out loud. <laughs> At my age, and with my sort of reputation, what am I doing? But I've done it. And, hey, so there you go. I mean, let's... It's for the benefit of the kids of this club and this community. I think that's what this is all about. The club replaced the work with a replica. They had hoped to sell the original. It could be worth hundreds of thousands of dollars. It's like the, the unknown millionaires walk through your door sort of thing. And all I'm suggesting is at the end of the day, it was put there for a reason. I think, I really generally think that Banksy been a Bristolian, has seen that we've got a plight and we've got need and he's done something about it by putting that there. But the city council, which owns the wall, says it belongs to them, and the artwork has now been removed from the club. It'll go on display at a local art gallery, and a box will sit next to it so that the public can donate money to the youth club. Harry Smith, Al Jazeera.